Joining us now, a friend of Mr. Comey and former federal prosecutor, Walter Mack. Thank you, Walter, for coming on. As a friend of Comey, what is it, how does it impact you to hear him say that? I would say the first thought when I watched that last night was where was his staff, where were those around him with comparable experience to overcome whatever beaten down views he had because at least my experience is that when you feel beaten down your decision making is impacted and that's when you need people around you to get you to think a little bit about your situation and what you're supposed to do about it. We understand this was a five-hour interview that ABC condensed to one hour, and there was so much in it. Uh, they did release the full transcript. Did you hear anything or learn anything that surprised you? Well, I, I would say that uh, most people, such as Jim and me and others without experience, are very reluctant to be in produced pieces uh, and interviews. So when I saw how edited the interview was and in many ways I'm, I was wondering whether he was making the right decision to be interviewed outside of the legal process which he is is part of right now he put himself out there clearly but then he in his book and and uh, some of his comments that he's made on air on in these interviews commenting on orange skin and small hands I mean if he wanted the focus to be on what he sees as a serious threat to the office of the presidency why go there why even talk about the president's appearance I'm not going to justify that myself uh, I tend uh, the only time I talk to the press is in the courtroom is, is and that is when I'm explaining myself either to a professional and I think you run the risk of lowering your uh, platform by interacting and going at all personal. And he may regret it. I, I hope his advisors, I'm not one of them, have considered that in terms of how he conducts himself last night and in the, in the ensuing time, whether going on book tours and interacting and perhaps lowering his own credibility in order to deal with what's coming his way. I'm not sure it enhances his reputation. I do need to read his book because my guess is that he, these portions that were selected are what are most newsworthy, but omit the buildup to his positions of leadership, integrity.